The capital region is seeing an increase in COVID cases believed to stem from the more transmissible subvariant known as BA2. We are keeping a close eye on the data tracker from the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. And at last check, nine counties in the capital region were at high levels of new cases. Albany County reported two new deaths today, a man in his 50s and a man in his 80s. Warren County lost a person in their 60s today. Dan Levy looks at how the rise in cases is impacting a local school district. Over the course of this past week, there have been more reported cases of COVID-19 in the Albany School District than there have been in the previous 16 months since the pandemic began. And that forced district officials to raise a caution flag. By the end of the day Friday, there are right around 100 new COVID cases confirmed among students and staff in the Albany school community. And so with that increase, knowing that we are in a high transmission area, then we're looking at all those safety protocols that we are accentuating and making sure that we emphasize that with our parents. And one of the key things is wearing a mask. At this point, Dr. Adams says indoor mask wearing in district school buildings is strongly encouraged. It is not a mandate. We're following the guidance as we have with regard to the Albany County Department of Health, uh, listening to all of the health care professionals. On the school district's Facebook page, folks are already weighing in. One person wrote, so you want to tell a bunch of kids who finally get a normal experience in school after two years that they should maybe start wearing a mask again? No freaking thanks. Another person chimed in, it's a hard no. Perhaps sensing a misunderstanding, a school official responded, many students in our schools are still wearing masks in our district. No one is forcing them to, not even now when case numbers are so high. The superintendent stresses all decisions are made in the best interest of public health. If our numbers continue to increase in the county as well as in our district, then we may have to make some additional decisions. The district also urges everyone over the age of five to get fully vaccinated. In Albany with coverage you can trust. Dan Levy, News Channel 13.